Hello everyone, welcome back and if you are new to my channel, Tech Geek is all about latest tech and gadgets. Today's video we are going to have a look at this GPS enabled 4K dash cam from Blue Sky C. If you are interested in this dash cam, you can find the product link in the description below. Without further ado, let's get started. The product came inside this cardboard packaging and some key features are printed on the side. In terms of unboxing, you will find the dash cam on the top, followed by the GPS enabled adhesive mount, car charger that has extra USB port, and last detailed user guide with all the relevant instructions regarding the setting up. In terms of the design and the build quality, this dash cam is very light in weight and measures about 36 by 1.5 by 0.9 inches in size. Input voltage is 5V 1.5 Amp and working temperature is minus 20 to 70 Celsius. This dash cam has Sony IMX415 8 megapixel imaging sensor with f1.6 aperture to capture detail and clear image of road signs and license plate with high resolution. Furthermore, WDR function records a wide dynamic range of light levels that can capture much better video even in a low light condition. It supports class 10 micro SD card and can be used up to 256 GB. Next to the SD card slot you can find the power button and the navigation tactile buttons on the other side. Bottom of the device you can see the reset button and plenty of air vent for reduce the heat and speaker grill. And last on the top you can find the rear camera input, power input and the camera mount. This camera windshield mount has an inbuilt GPS antenna hidden inside and mount can be easily tilted according to your choice. Furthermore, you get 3.16 inches IPS white color screen with this dash cam. In terms of setting up and installation, it is very easy and same as any other dash cams in the market. You can carefully install the windshield mount and attach the dash cam. Charging cable has good length which helps for internal wiring. Once again, you can easily tilt up and down once it's installed and it is recommended to format the SD card before you use the camera for the first time. In terms of features and functions of device, you can easily navigate through using the buttons on the side. As you can see, it has a very clean and user-friendly interface. You can control and adjust the resolution level, audio level, enable date stamp, loop recording, G-sensor level, choose the parking mode you want, time lap duration, which capture the entire journey and easy to show it to someone easily and quickly, and enable motion detection, and even you can register your number plate. Furthermore, you can enable the speed and GPS stamps and choose the speed unit you want. Also, you can enable the Wi-Fi, format the SD card, choose language, date and time setup with the time zone, even adjust the screen timeout. You can sync dashcam data with the mobile phone using a UCAM smart app which is available in both iOS and Android app stores. Setting up is very easy and all you need to do is simply follow the on-screen instruction and connect the camera over the Wi-Fi. Once it's connected, you can see the live feedback. Furthermore, you can customize camera settings which I already mentioned earlier in the video, such as adjust the video resolution, loop recording, etc. Once it's connected to your phone over the Wi-Fi on the go, it is great for waving and sharing your footage to the relevant authorities such as your insurance company. Unfortunately, if you record 4K footage, it takes time when it comes to transfer the video clip between dashcam to the smartphone due to the file size. Let's take a look at some video clips I have taken. As you can see, it can capture very good detail and quality feedback. Road signs and all other moving objects are very clear to see. Also, you can see the date, speed and the timestamp on bottom left corner. Once again, thanks to the low light capable image sensor, it can record detail and clear video even in a night mode.
Furthermore, you can see the GPS route on the Google map when you play the video in the app. You can use this dash cam for 24 hour parking monitoring purpose. However, it required a hardware kit which you can purchase separately. Furthermore, it has three parking modes including motion detection, time lapse, and buffering parking mode. In buffered parking mode, a 30 second video, 10 second before, and 20 second after the impact will be saved in the memory card if the dash cam was tricked by an impact within the total duration of the car parking mode. So with all that being said, if you're looking for decent dash cam with app control as well as GPS enabled, this Blue Sky C B4K dash cam is worth to try. Once again, many thanks for watching and let me know what you think about this dash cam. If you like the content, please hit the like and do subscribe to see more videos like this. And see you again with another video.